looks like it might have gone forward, but referee Jackson lets it go. Well, they get the penalty anyway. How about getting back? Bit of rain. Bryn Gatlin to contend with here. He struck it well, though. And Bryn Gatlin. Well, he got the last points of the 2016 season. He gets the first of the 2017 season for Harbour. And they're in front by 3-0. to nil. Trying to put the heat on at scrum time, but... Harbour again controlling it. High kick for Lee to get after this time. And again, players really letting the ball bounce. And Lee's got it for Harbour. Well, that's not great defending at the back from Otago. And it's going to put them under a world of pressure here. Eves shovels it on. Nicely taken by Gatland on the fingertips. Racing inside the 22. There it is again for Harbour. Carly Tuiotti always can be relied on to run the ball up straight and hard. Gatlin spots it, Gatlin, Gatlin turns it back and field, and Sean Stevenson has his first try for Harbour. But Gatlin was masterful in that. Here's a steal. The Otago boys should have been up in the air for that. They should have got that. Tavita Lee's too dangerous. Here we see Gatlin. He spots the hole. The opportunity's there. It's been a one-man show tonight. Well, two very good reads from Bryn Gatlin carrying the ball. Yeah, now got a bit of a scrap over on the hall. Uh, and Fettis didn't take too kindly to being hey, shunted hey, hey, into the ball. Ace. Ace, get out. So, Sekunaya Pule with the throw. Josh Dixon wins it. Targo looking a bit better, now slicing straight through the middle is Jonathan Ruru. And Otago have their first try. And with 20 minutes to go, just a sense they might be working their way back into this game. Well, I think it's uh, the Harbour captain he's burned here. Thought he had him covered, Parsons didn't get a hand on him. Parsons. And under a bit of pressure too. And the ball's been lost, scooped up, and Otago are in again. Well, hold the phone. I, th I think we need to have a look at this again. Well, he's going to have a look at it again. I just having a look at that replay. It did look as though there was a suggestion of a knock-on. Tom Rowe was the man who went up, and that was what James Parsons was complaining about. And he was told to go away by Glenn Jackson. But just have a look here. Now, if he's got a finger to that. This try is not going to stand. Have a look here. This will be the angle. Oh. Yep. It's a roar from the it. crowd. Okay. No try. Oh, boy. They've dodged a big bullet here, North Harbour. No target's taken them so long to get going in the game. Been denied one try. Here they go, looking for another one. Ioani floats it wide, scoop into the corner. Well, they do get that try eventually. Oh, Jonathan Rudu just changed it up there. Josh Ioani calling for it. Skip pass to Mitchell Scott, who scores in the corner. Skied and field taken by Tomkinson. Kuroi could open them up. Decides to kick. Awkward and uh, taken down coolly by Bryn Gatlin. Gets the off by the way to Stevenson. Sean Stevenson breaking. He's got support players with him. Well, he needed to pass. Tavita Lee still got it though. Oh, then he throws a loose pass. Loses it forward. Well. I think that try was on for Harbour. They've made a couple of mistakes, though. Stay onside! Tyrell, but it's still there. Oh, squirts away. One mistake too many. And Harbour hang on for their first win of the season. Desperate attempt in the second half by Otago to come back from a very long way in difficult conditions, but it falls just short. Harbour get the win 19 to 17 case.